team. Good morning, team. Pray all is well with everybody. I just got a package in the mail. I love packages in the mail, team. I love. Let me show you something, team. Let me show you something. Especially Amazon packages, team. I love Amazon, team. I shop on eBay. My wife mentioned that. I'm not. For those of you who are scared to shop on eBay, let me tell you something. I'm scared. That, <laughs> I'm scared. In my experiences, team, I have never been robbed. Now, let me tell you, y'all know when them court shows was at the height of their success or whatever, them court shows, I don't know, the court shows probably still come on. We don't watch court shows. But anyway, I seen a guy on there because he got some rims off eBay and it wasn't what they were supposed to be. So he's taking the guy to court. Now, let me tell you now, in this day and time, eBay have made a bunch of changes. That can't happen no more. Okay. Say if I, now let me tell you something, my camera, my camera came off eBay used, my main camera. All right, team, check this out. I sell you something. You send me, you send the money. You, you make your payment on eBay. I do not get that money to around two or three days after you receive the product, which means you have time to complain to eBay. So there's no way you can get robbed. Once you get that package, this is what I would do. Once you get that package, you better check it out. Make sure everything, don't put it aside like, oh, I'll check it this weekend because I'm tired from working. It's Monday. You're going to check it on the weekend. No, now the person got their money and you ain't checked the package yet. When you get the package, this is an eBay tutorial. When you get your package, open it up. Check it. If it's electronics, make sure everything functioning right before that person get the money. And eBay will stop the payment. All right. Now, with that said, my wife's scared of eBay. I have never been robbed. Well, I've been I've been robbed online, but not from eBay. Because, team, y'all the first people I'm telling this. I thought when I first got online on AOL, you know, on dial-up, I thought that everybody was paying for downloading music. So what I did... I gave them my credit card information online and I was robbed for that week check and the next week check. I thought, because look, my supervisor was downloading music and I thought he was paying for it. And then after I got robbed, I was like, man, I got robbed. He's like, you pay for me? I don't pay for no music. I didn't know people were downloading music for free. But anyway, this is what I got in the mail. I done babbled. This what I got in the mail. It's going to be my new thing, along with, um, what's that band? Wings. Blue. My wife likes this. It's important for y'all to wear what your spouse like, not just what you like. Mm -hmm. And I like it. I like it, too. It's it's just. That's the a, blue carpet? It's the blue bag. It's not the other one. I like the blue carpet. Yeah, she liked the blue better. I like the other one, too. But my wife liked the blue. Yeah, yeah it's, it got a fresh smell. Kind of remind me of, like. Cool water, don't smell like cool water, but cool water got a fresh scent. So, yeah, so this came in the mail, team. And something else came in the mail. Hold that, baby. Pick the team up, baby. Sorry. What's up, team? I know I look a hot mess. Something else came in the mail. I'm shocked. Maybe my husband got me something. I'm sitting up here writing my book. Like, I wrote, like, three chapters already. I'm trying to get it done. Because I just got a new client. Oh, my God, what is this? Torn and Kimberly Moses. What is it, babe? Let's see. I don't know what it is. You ask me. I don't know what it is. You want me to open it? Or you want to open it? You open it. Okay, babe. See, I'm trying to share. I don't want to steal it. Wait, wait. Is the light bad? Yeah, because I can't see. I'm trying to hold it like that on me. Still ain't the best. Okay, there you go. There you go. That's better. Now, team, we just got a package in the mail. I just told you we love packages. Amazon package. Somebody sent us a package, babe, but you bought something. No, if you bought something, we'll say Tron and Kimberly. Okay. Huh? Okay, I think. Okay, you bought us something? I think it's like skew, not skewers, but skimmer, she said. Oh, uh, okay. I'm not sure. That was fast. I see, I see some of it, man. Is it? What is it? Oh, I'm going to be frying, team. I'm going to be frying. 
Thank you, Aunt Faye. Yes. Love you. Such wow. a blessing. Yes. Wow. Oh, she did. She did say, oh, so specialist. Wow. I never had that before. Stainless steel skimmer. Skimmer. She told me about that. I was like, a what? <laughs> yes. Stainless oh. steel skimmers. I need to go fry something. Oh, okra. I got some okra. I love fried okra. I don't know about you guys. I should go fry some fried okra. I got, I got some vegetable oil and granola oil before I start getting busy again and writing someone else's book. So I'd rather write my book than someone else's book. That's my confession. You know, because yeah. I got an assignment on my life I got to complete. So, yeah, I don't um, mind helping others out, but I got to do what God Help called. me out. But yeah, I do help you. But you don't, give me your book. I told you. I said, give me your book so I can fix it. Don't do that. Ouch. You felt that? Mm. I heard it. I know. I got old eyelash glue on me. So, babe, trying to, I took off my, he called them spiders. I took them off. Mm. Yeah, but babe, give me your book, seriously. I'm not going to fix it. Don't do this if you ain't married. Don't do that after you remember. Baby, give me his book. He's been You're playing with fire. Don't play with fire. Play with fire, you get burned. It's going to lead to other stuff. Just felt like saying that. <laughs> I know yeah. that had nothing to do with the conversation, but give you what book? The book that you want to add it to. You said you want, you, look, Babe has about four books. Now, we did Who Touched Me. We, we edited it up, fixed it up. Get that book, His Journey to Jesus, Who Touched Who Touched Me. He got Where Are the Mentors and The Power Intercession. I told you the Empower Intercession was good. I read that book. It was really short. And the other one I took off line. Yeah, I, I want to add more content to I it. I didn't want to. Um, I took it off line. But what, what's the name of it? It's almost Spiritual Warfare or something, right? No, I ain't talking about that. Remember I told you that was on a computer I can't get in? Okay. A hard drive, I can't. It's not where the mentor's at? <laughs> no, baby. No. I don't know what other books I you can't. got. <laughs> it, it was, um, the reason I took it off uh, Amazon, because it was just one long chapter. And I read a book like that, and I, I just, and then, I didn't I didn't do my one long chapter cop, cop, copying off them. But what it was, actually, it was a, a Facebook note. Mm -hmm. And it was just so good and powerful. What I said, I said, you know what? Let me just put this in an ebook. And then I deleted it off Facebook. So now, really, yeah. Okay. But it was, it was good. It was good. What was it? What was it about? And that reminds me, like, um, someone contacted me recently. She had a long thing, and she didn't know how to turn to a book. So by the leading of the Holy Spirit, we was able to break it down for her. Now she can get, like, 10, 15 chapters out of what we gave her yesterday, I mean, the Holy Spirit. That's what I want to do for my babe. I want to dissect his long note and make it into chapters. We can do it. You smell me, babe? Come here. I gotta do, we just told the people you like, I, I gotta come all the way up on you. I smell them. No, I have a congestion because it's like an ice box here, you guys. We got a new air conditioning unit. It is freezing. I feel like I'm in a freezer. Like, you know how you go in those big, deep freezers, those walk-in freezers, like at a factory somewhere? That's how I feel in here. I'm cold. <laughs> and and so, I bet you her hands are cold. Let me see. Yeah, my hands are cold. Oh no, I can't. No. Well, maybe because I drank that. Drink, been drinking coffee. This hand is cold. I feel it. Uh, but yeah. So, anyways, I'm a little I, stuffy, so I can't smell that good. I call it killer frost. <laughs> From somebody, Flash. Somebody frost. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, Tim, I'm about to go back over here because yeah. when I come over here on your side of the office, people named Gigi Love say I'm, I'm vlog bombing. So let me go back over here. Yeah. All right, team. I, I'll catch y'all later. I'm going over here. And I'm about to go get on, I think. Yeah, I'm just going to just listen to some preaching. Build up my, build myself up in God. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Thanks I, again, RFA. Yeah, thank you again, woman of God. We appreciate you. Got a busy day today. Um, School of the Prophets tonight, class number two. First class was powerful. Uh, Holy Spirit gave word of knowledge. One of my students got healed, and then I think pretty much most of the new students, they got delivered. Uh, the power God hit them, and you know, it was beautiful. When you, whenever you prophesy and get somebody a word, they start crying or they start responding like that. You know, it's God. You're like, I have no idea what I'm saying, 
or XYZ and you know all the students are flowing you know underneath that anointing uh, during class so I, I thank God but anyways I don't want to talk your head off but I do want to say that I will not do any more teaching on, on, on class online this year but I will do another class or prophetic training at my conference so sign up you guys empowering the new me conference I'm telling you I'm, I'm so blessed people come from Alabama Florida, New York, just different areas, and uh, Missouri is really humbling. Wait, why are you in the corner up there? Oh. <laughs> you got like, lamps still over there. Yeah, I just, I look rough. That's why I want you to be in the camera. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You'll be hearing all people say, Prophetess, you can never look rough. Well, guys, I... Prophetess, you beautiful widow without makeup. I feel like a hot mess. But, you know, I decided to uh, not wear weave until the conference. <laughs> That's my confession. So at the conference, I'm going to get my hair done and I'm going to get some weave in, you guys, because when you start sweating, you know, when I start sweating, my hair puffs, is, you know, poofs out. So I want to have my hair done so, you know, I could look cute and preach the gospel. This is <laughs> Yeah, oh, Star Nicole's coming. Listen, you guys, my, my conference last year in Colorado, Empowering the New Me, this is year number two of this conference. She did my makeup. And I look like a whole nother person. And babe was like, who we're that? Show, we're gonna show a picture of that. Yeah, I just like, I, and at first I was scared. I was like, uh-uh, don't put all this on me. No, I don't wanna look like no clown because <laughs> I had a bad experience. I got my, my makeup done for prom. Uh, and this lady did it, uh, what is it, Clinique or something like that? The Clinique, the, the Cl I just said it right. Clinique. The yeah. Clinique uh, booth at the mall. And she had me looking like Michael Jackson. You know, when the camera hit, it oh, was no. all white, you know, and then <laughs> <laughs> and then my neck was like darker. It just looked horrible. And I was like, never again. So I was always scared. That just traumatized me from wearing makeup. And they were all in my photos. Like every photo I had, I had a white face. So I'm just like, <laughs> I, I ain't show nobody those prom pictures. I was like, ah. I want to see them. I think my mother got those pictures. I didn't take those pictures with me. They were horrible. So I was like, I'll never wear makeup. So I see your Billie Jean when, when Star Nicole did my makeup for my conference last year, I was like, wow, she had me looking like something, like you know, yes. like a. Yeah, my sister seen up there. She said, like, that girl, that person know what they doing. Yeah, she hooked me up. Yeah, as soon as I walked into the building, everybody's like, oh my god, who did your makeup? You look so beautiful. Like I was like, really? So you say I'm ugly now without the makeup? <laughs> Hello. Yeah, but it's like you look so beautiful. It's like okay, so I tried to. I've been trying to do my makeup like that, but I'm learning. Yeah, you've been trying. Um, hey, he's so honest. God, you get on my nerves. But uh, I'll get it. I'll get it. But yeah, yeah. I gotta. Yeah. I need to be too old make it. Yeah. So, anyways, it's good to have a good friend that you know know how to do things. And y'all saw in her life. Her name is Star Nicole Lord. Yeah. 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 So. Anyways, anyways, let me get off of here and talk talk y'all head off. Yeah. Um. <laughs> let me show them. Let me show them one photo from that shoot since they did see the photo shoot. Since y'all did see the photo shoot team, I want to show y'all one photo from that shoot. See that? Beautiful, beautiful. My wife was with me in the, y'all don't see that in the, in the uh, video, but she was with me and she assisted. Things like that, that's, that's a blessing. Flowers right there. Look at them burgundy flowers. Y'all, I was getting ready to throw them away. <laughs> but then Bay wanted to vlog, so. Yeah, Bay's getting ready to vlog. 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 Uh, August 22nd. August 22nd. Right, Ben? Yeah. August 22nd. Damn. And then. Right. So take that cool feedback. Anyway, team, we love you. It's been real. It's been fun. Yeah. We're we out of here, team. We'll catch y'all on the next one. Deuces.